Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play Monkey Island. In the last episode, we survived an attemptation of murder on our life by Mr. Sheriff Shinetop, or whatever his name is. And now we're going to see my favorite character, Stan. Howdy! <laughs> I'm Stan of Stan's previously owned vessel, <laughs> and I'd stand on my head to make you a deal. I bet what you would. What sort of Stan. craft are you looking for? Big, one that, fast, slow. One that floats. You want it? I got it. And if I don't got it, I'll get it. I want to make you a deal that you're happy with. Really? Because if you're not happy, I'm not happy. But I know you're going to leave here happy today. <laughs> How do I know? Just look at all these ships. I don't see a single I've ship. I've got something for everyone. Something Come, for everyone. Come, take a look around. Oh, look at all these ships. So tell me. <laughs> Feel like what are you interested in looking at today? Uh, I need something spiffy. Spiffy blue. The spiffy blue that one. Spiffy blue one by your office looks nice. Of course it does. It's mine. Oh. And it's not for sale. Oh, how about that? <laughs> what else can I show you? Oh, we need the one in the back, ladies and gentlemen. Uh... Uh, I can't remember which one to pick. I don't really have that much to spend. Probably that one. Have no fear. Every ship I sell is a bargain. Is if it? you're looking for a real steal. Really real steal. I've got just the boat for you. Hook me up, Walk Stan. Walk this way. Walk this way. Walk this way. I don't know if I can shake my arms like that. I don't know if I do that. This here is the famous Sea Monkey. Ah, the good the old only sea monkey. ship ever to make it to Monkey Island oh. and come back with anyone aboard left alive. Really? Or should I say anything? What's that supposed you to mean? You see, the previous owners of this ship were two adventurous pirates. Mm -hmm. They set off, like many before, to find the legendary secret of Monkey Island. Really? And like many before, they disappeared forever. Well, that sucks. Their fate? A mystery. So they didn't come back Almost at all. as mysterious as how this ship returned to Melee Island without a single human aboard. Okay, that is Some mysterious. Some claim it was sailed back by a crew of chimps. It might have been. Chimps? There aren't any chimps in the Caribbean. Oh, shut up. It makes a good story. <laughs> anyway, this baby's mine now. That is, until someone makes me an offer. What Not kind right. of price range were you thinking of? Well, ladies and gentlemen, we actually can't buy it yet. Oh, well, never mind. We're going to need to get it on credit. Actually, I was hoping to get one on credit. Sorry, kid. Neither a borrower nor a lender be. That's just old Stan's philosophy. Or I think if we do. If you've got a job, the yeah, storekeeper that, in that, town right might extend you some credit. Exactly. Then we have something to talk about. Unless, of course, you've already got some other means of financing. Well, we don't. On second thought, so now we need to go pre procure some credit. Okay, but I got five other guys coming back to look at this baby today. Don't count on it being here if you change your mind. I so doubt it. Everybody what left the else island can stand. I show you? Nothing. I gotta go. Actually, I'd like to go think about it some more. Sure, sure. Think it over. I don't want you to feel pressured or anything. <laughs> Bye now. I will be right back, Stan. So, ladies and gentlemen, if you remember, in the first episode, I think, we did... I forgot to give you my card. How did you get in front of me? And here's something else to remember me by. A compass? An extra strong magnetic compass. Oh, With interesting. With your picture on it. That's right. <laughs> It always points directly back here. What? So if you're looking for a good deal, you know where to go. Well, I'll that's near right you. here when you come back. But I can't guarantee that any of these ships will. No. Right. They're moving fast today. Even though everybody's yes, already left this freaking can't island stand. Keep anything in stock. He'll be back. They always come back, right? And I will be back. Very important that we got those things. Now we need to go to the village. If you remember in the first episode, ladies and gentlemen, we actually got a job as a circus performer. We did, uh, 
We got shot out of a cannon, and that pretty much qualifies as a job in this game. So now, we need to go see the ship, or the store owner. And, um... Yeah, we're going to tell him we have a job, and he's going to extend us a line of credit. And we're going to use that credit to go buy that boat. Even though we actually never pay for it. Ever. Ever! But anyway... This game, I would say it's probably about halfway done now, all things considered. I don't think there's two more hours left in it. Anyway, this game is fun. If you guys don't have this game, I don't know if they'd have it at GameStop. They might. I don't know. But, uh... It's good stuff. It's not not good stuff. Hey, where'd you go? I went to see the Swordmaster. Halfway across the island to try and get you a reservation with the Swordmaster, who, by the way, says you can go jump in the lake. And when I come back, whew, you're gone. <sighs> so all you know how to do is I talk. Do you a favor again? I think I should ask him to go find the Swordmaster again. I need a line of credit. I'm interested in procuring a note of credit. You are. I. Uh, okay, now we need to remember. Job. Yes, I do. Yes, of course I do. All right. I'll get one of my notes and we'll fill it out. Okay, you need to pay attention to this, ladies and gentlemen. Focus on what he does. Left. Left up. Right. I've already forgotten. Left to a circle. Then right. Then da I've already forgotten. I've, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to see it again. I have to write it Let's down. Let's see here. What did you say your occupation was? Never mind. To be honest, sir, I'm between jobs. I appreciate your honesty. Yeah. But I didn't get to be 83 by being no jackass. <laughs> no job, no credit. <laughs> Come see me when you land a job, and we'll talk. Can you just open that safe again, please? <laughs> Thank you. Okay, it rotated. All, it did a full circle to the left, then right once. I remember that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And down. Down to the left, and then a circle back around. Okay. Okay. So, it's going to be different every time you play the game, ladies and gentlemen, so you want to remember that. What else do you want? Um, I need you to I'm sword master, the please. Sword <laughs> Look, I told you she doesn't want to see you. Maybe if you asked her again? <laughs> hmm. I guess I could hike all the way over there <laughs> again. again. <laughs> Be right back. Goodbye, man. You leave me alone and with your touch safe. Anything. Oh, no, no. I'm just going to be touching. I'm going to be putting my hands all over your lines of credit. You don't even know. Okay, so we make a circle to the left, right? Let's see. Now, this one's awkward. Pull it and then pull it again, but now we gotta push it. No, we don't. Dang it. Okay, uh, pull, 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 pull button. Okay, so apparently he's gotta pull it all the time. Okay, pull the handle. Well, okay, so it circles all the way around that, and now we need to push it. Right, and then we need to go to the left. All the way back down. Pull it. Okay, I think that just reset it. Okay, that's fine. Okay, we need to make a complete circle, right? So we keep pulling it. Pull it, and then push it. Or, yeah, push it. It's hard to remember sometimes. Push it, and then go to the left. Down. Like that. And then we need to make a right. My right, oh, you go to the right all the way, push it, and then push it again, and then uh, push it again, and then push it again. Oh. Ah! There's nothing in here but this note. Take it! Take thine note. There we go. Now we got our line of credit. Now we go back to that. was confusing. It's hard to remember stuff like that, but um, for me it is anyway. All right, so we got our note of credit. And he's on his way back to the... He won't even know what hit him by the time he gets back. And we're going to get that boat. We don't have any money, though. That's the thing. We we have we has no money. We're never going to pay this note. Ever. Ever. This note is never, ever, ever, ever going to get paid back. But that's okay, because I'm Guybrush Threepwood. 
Maybe he paid it back in the second one. In the second game. I don't know. Unfortunately, the shopkeeper is not in the second one, so that's the last time we're ever going to see him. Send him on some errand that we're never going to see him again. Just like everybody else. But anyway, let's go get a boat. I'm down. And after that, I'm going to start making these videos and I'm going to take a freaking nap. Nothing is going to stop me from taking a nap today. I'm tired and i got to go... I'm going to see my dad about 6 o'clock. It's about a 45 minute drive. So I got to... No. Get a tight little 12 hour nap. <laughs> At what point does napping become sleeping? You know what I mean? Howdy! Alright, Stan. Great to see you again. How's that ship doing? I knew you'd come back. Everybody does. Mm -hmm. You know why they come back? Because they like cars. Just look at all these ships. Oh my goodness! I've look got at those something ships. for everyone. Mm -hmm. Come, take a look around. Where do you get another of those hats? I want one of those hats, please. So, what else can I show you? I like to see the same ship again. Uh, could I see the cheap one again? I knew it. I knew it. Just can't get her out of your mind, can you? Oh, she's an angel. Walk this way. Dun 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 Stand you ships. Dun 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 Hard to stay away from a good mystery, isn't it? Yes, it is. What kind of price range were you thinking of? Credit time. I got credit from the storekeeper. Will you take it? Hey, of course. Word, Your homie. credit's always good at stands. Better be. It doesn't matter if you've had credit problems Your credit's in the always, past. always good here, Mr. Torrance. Divorce? Chronic gambling mishaps? Chronic? I mean, who am I to judge? You're right? the salesman, not the judge, dude. If the storekeeper trusts you enough to give you a letter of credit, then you must be an honest man with a steady income. Right? Kind uh, of. Right. Let's get down to brass tack, shall we? Let's do it. I know you want it. You know you want it. Mm-hmm. And I know that you know that I want to sell it, so... <laughs> Let's talk extras. Let's talk extras. Extras? You want to talk extras? I do. Great! This baby's loaded with extras. For instance... Did I tell you about the porthole defoggers? <laughs> I think I can live without that. I think I can live without that particular... You have to do this, ladies and gentlemen, or else the price is too high. Okay, but don't blame me if you run into an iceberg or something. Hey, Titanic jokes are not funny. There's more. Did I tell you about the anti-lock anchor? I don't think I need that. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Sure, throw safety to the wind. Yeah, who needs wait, safety? there's more. Did I tell you about the rack and pinion rudder? No, I missed that. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Well, I guess it'll float without it. <laughs> float. Barely. <laughs> but wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the balloon? A nice rudder does not covers? a boat make. I, I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Did you just say velour sails? Are you kidding me? Hey, travel light. I can understand that, sure. Of course. Mutiny is an ugly word. Ooh, but wait, trying to get inside my head. More. Did I tell you about the tachometer? I don't need that. I think I can live without <laughs> that particular. You really have to do this over and over. Wow, does your wife know you're such a cheapskate? Ooh. But wait, there's more. Did what I you tell got? you about the elevator made with wood from burgundy wine casks? You really trying to sell me a ship with an elevator in it? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Yeah, I guess that is kind of decadent, isn't it? Kind of. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about this simulated wood siding? Simulated wood siding, huh? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. <laughs> okay, but I'm telling you, barnacles hate simulated I, wood. I don't don't but care. wait, there's more. As long as it keeps Davy Jones Did I away. Tell you about the porthole defogger. All right, and that's all that we've got. Enough about extras already. This loops back around. Okay, where were we? What do you? I'd like to I'd make like an to offer. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? How about two thousand? I'd like to pay two thousand pieces of eight. 
Sure, I guess we can start out at the bottom. <laughs> I got all day. Hmm. I'm going to be getting a whole new shipment next week, so you got me over a barrel. All right. I've got to sell this baby, even if it means losing my shirt. Hmm. Well. I'd like to make you an offer. Let's go up on the offer, then. Great. How much? It's not good enough. How about four? Okay, okay. Four thousand pieces of eight. That's a little bit more like it, but not much. Hey, excuse me. I know you can try harder than that. I just doubled. Just tell me, what would it take to get you to sail this ship away today? Uh, 4,000 pieces of I'd eight. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? I guess we go with 5,000. All right, 5,000, but that's my final offer. 5,000 pieces of eight? 5,000. Okay, okay. Yes! It's killing me, but okay. That's and the I way you do I was it. gonna give my children Christmas presents this Ooh, year. Ooh, sad. Just take it out of here. I'm glad to get rid of it. Oh, yeah. Do you have that note from the storekeeper on you? I do. Thanks. <laughs> I've got to run these numbers by my boss. He'll think I'm nuts, but I'll talk him into it. You meet me at the dock with your crew. I'll bring the ship and the papers. I just want to say that I really feel like we got to know each other today. I mean, I uh, really felt some bonding here. Uh, and I, I don't, don't know about just that. say that to everybody. Yes, you do. I it's know you do. It's been great doing business with you. Don't lie to me, Stan. Really? Sucker. <laughs> See you at the dock, and don't forget your crew. All three of them. All right. So now we got a ship and no crew, huh? That's no good. Can I go in here? Can I, I want to go in that door. I sold the ship. Can you believe it? Uh. I'm off on a long vacation spending some poor sucker's money. Arrivederci, baby. That's me. Stan. Dang it, Stan. <laughs> Uh, actually, he's spending a note of credit. He's not spending anything, technically. Okay, so now we've got a ship and no crew. We've got to fix that. And if you think about it, there's only... We've already met two people, but we haven't met the third person yet. We are going to set our friend, what's-his-face, free from prison. This is what we're going to do. Now, this might be one of the hardest things to do in this game. It's not really, really bad. But at the same time, it it could be. And, well, I hope I don't screw it up. It's not so, so bad, but this is what we got to do. We got to pick up mugs, all right? Probably, probably get three, but you only need two. All right. Now, if you remember what the guy said at the beginning of the game what grog was made out of it was made out of like sulfuric acid and battery acid and acetone and all this crazy stuff and well that's what we need to do that's full of grog and we are going to use the mug that seem to work no 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 you use the mug use the mug with the barrel and now we've got a cup of eating right through the mug exactly we got a cup of grog, but it's eating through the mug. And what we have to do is we have to very quickly, very quickly not waste our time here by walking back and forth. We have to hurry and get to that jail cell as quickly as possible before it melts. The only thing is, after a certain point, it melts so much that you can't put it in another cup. And that's why I got three of them. Because now, right now, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to drop, use this with... Oh, dang it. Dang it. Don't do this to me. Use this with this. There we go. And then it reset the cup. And now you only need one extra mug cup, but I got... A, a, you only need two of them, but I got three of them. Just to be sure. You, ne you never know what might happen between here and the jail cell. Things will start melting any time now. Hopefully I'll get there in time. Hang on, dude. I'm trying to get the... Oh, uh, Let's see if I can use this with this. Maybe. Well, this mug isn't much use anymore. Oh god. Looks like a I, fine I, pewter tankard. I just lost it! <laughs> Dang it! 
Ah! So you have to do it while it's still in the relative form of a mug. So, back to the place again. Dang it. I remember the first time I did this, I got it right the first time. I had to look it up because I didn't understand. I, I knew I had to get the grog on it. I, I knew that. But I just didn't understand really how to get... Because it melted. If you move as fast as you can, you will get right there to the jail cell. And it, the cup will die. So you really only need two. But still, I just... I, I need to... <sighs> That's exactly what I tried to avoid doing that right there by getting three moves. But it still happened. So use mug with barrel. And then get that guy out of there, thump weed. Okay, we can do this. Ooh, just, a, just, a, just a mug of grog. I can do this. So I'm assuming that you can. Um, you have to use it when it. It looks like a, a mug. You, you can't use it when it's about to fall apart. But you can transfer it over when it's about to fall apart, which is probably what we're going to do again. Go! Thumpweed! Okay. Dang grog. Trying to be all willy-nilly with me. Okay, hang on. You, oh, no! Not the... Oh, I can't use it now. Use this with this. I can't get anything out of that. Mark. Are you kidding me? God! Maybe you do need three of them. I swear I did it with two. Damn, I'm just gonna have to start turning them over right when it starts to, to you know fall apart. I know you can do it with two. I did it with two. Oh, man. I don't know what to tell you, ladies and gentlemen. It's almost too far of a walk. Almost. Alright. I pick that one up. Just to be sure. Give me this, just to be sure. You never know. I'm going to switch it over three times. Just to be safe. Alright. Use <coughs> mug with barrel. And get out of here. You know, why, why wouldn't he just pick up the barrel? Have the chef take the barrel to the jail cell. That makes more sense, doesn't it? Well, kind of. In an overkill kind of way it does. Alright. One more time, Thump Wind. We can do this. I'm going to flip it over right now, though. Use this with this. And there you go. All right, dang grog! Why are you so potent? So now I'm gonna get to the jail cell. I'm gonna flip it over one more time because my name is Guybrush Threepwood, and I can do whatever I want to. When I'm up here and I got the microphone, I can say whatever I want to. Looks like a fine to. pewter tankard. Shut up! Don't 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 screw with me. All right, now we use this grog with the lock. Booyah! Take it. Hey, great! A drink! It's not for you. I'm real thirsty. Well, it kind of is for you, but not Yikes. exactly. Good lord. Wow! And to think I used to drink that stuff. I know, right? I'm free! Freedom oh, never yeah. smelt so good yet. If there's anything I can ever do for you, join my crew. Well, actually, there is something. I'm looking for brave people to join my crew and sail off to Monkey Island with me to rescue the governor. She's been abducted by the fearsome pirate LeChuck and is mm. being held against her will somewhere in the You probably shouldn't have said that. You probably shouldn't have said that, Gabrush. I see. Well, Jess, mmm. LeChuck, you say. Exactly. Well, Jess, yes, of course. We must sail to Monkey Island and... <gasps> hey, look behind you! I three-headed monkey! What? <laughs> I can't believe I fell for that. Hey, I would have turned around Pretty too. Good trick though. Yeah, I agree. What's this? Is this a note? That looks like a note. All right. 
Well, that's one crew member. Even though he didn't agree to it, he's gonna be the crew member. Meanwhile, having just returned from melee, LeChuck and his crew find their old hiding place in the underground rivers of Monkey Island the and with drop them. anchor. Captain, sir. I what? just stopped by to congratulate you on your kidnapping mission. Captain? Uh-oh. Captain, are you alright? Oh my goodness. It was LeChuck the whole time. Oh my goodness. Never felt better. <laughs> and how fares our prisoner? Ah, yes, the uh, prisoner. <laughs> We had a little trouble. What kind of trouble? Trouble! <laughs> no, 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 <laughs> nothing to worry about, sir. Everything's under control. She escaped a few times. What? But we've got her locked up in the brig. No one's getting in or out of there. For your sake, I hope not. With years of planning almost destroyed by my death, I'm not taking any chances now. You took care of Mr. Threepwood then? Hmm. Guy Brush Threepwood will not be a problem. I wish I could roll my arms. At hours. this very moment, he's 20 feet underwater. No, no. Probably bloated up like a fattened pig. His eyes being eaten out by crabs. Blech. Fish pecking at his fingers. Kind of makes you wish you were there to watch. <laughs> Not exactly. Ah, yes, sir. <laughs> sure does it that. Now, go check on the route. Make sure it's locked up tight. Aye, aye, Captain. Well, that was a nice little break from reality. But now, we must get another member of our crew. And if you can imagine who it might be, we've only met two special people. We are going to go talk to the sword master. Well, no, we met the, the trainer. But the trainer is not going to be one of your crew. I don't think you can make him part of your crew. I've never tried. Part of me wants to try, but I, I seriously doubt. I think I just kind of want to stick with the originals that I've always used. But probably the only ones you can. You know how these games, it may seem like there's an infinite amount of ways to do stuff when really there's only one. That's how these kind of games like to operate. So, with that being said, we're just going to keep it keeping it gangsta. And we're going to talk to the Swordmaster, get her to join. All you have to do is talk to her, luckily. You don't have to convince her of something. You don't have to lie to her. Like you do most women to make them feel good. You just you tell her the truth. She's more than happy to facilitate. Facilitate. So what have been going on with you, ladies? You want to hang out, be rocking and rolling? My needs to be, man. Got my ant back, so I'm probably gonna work on that cover this weekend, probably tomorrow. Oh, but Sam, that's that's your day off. Remember? Yeah, you're probably right. I'm probably not gonna work on it tomorrow. Maybe next week. You've already got the T-shirt. I know. What do you want now? I need you. To the come governor's to me. been kidnapped. What? That's ridiculous. It's also true. Oh, no. Yeah. This looks bad. Very bad. Yeah. I'm getting a ship and a crew together to go rescue her. Hmm. I have a feeling I'm going to regret this, but count me in. Yay! I'll meet you at the dock. Word, homie. And then she just left me. But at least I got an answer out of her. The other guy didn't give me an answer. So now... Need one more person for our crew. And there's one place on this island that we haven't been to yet. And maybe that's the... I doubt the sword guy could join because there's no other reason to have this part of the island up here than to get this guy to join your crew. So let's go over there and talk to him. Never met this cat yet. Or ever. That's pretty cool. I'd party with him, you know. He's one of those guys. Hook Island. 
restrooms and I, I can't read that. I don't know what that says. All right. So let's get up here. And you've got to think, oh, well, Grybrush can just climb across that. Well, no, he actually can't. So what we got to do, that <laughs> that chicken that we picked up in the voodoo doctor's place, got to use a chicken with the cable, and it's, it's a pulley thing, and it gets us over there. <laughs> and now we need to go to the door and see what's going on with this guy, and that'll be just about all we have time for today, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all for watching. Oh, we're going to get this guy to join our crew, but we're not going to. We won't be able to do part two until hey, Monday. Oh, I don't horrible. like visitors. Who are you? I'm Gabrusly. <laughs> the governor's been kidnapped. What? That's preposterous. Oh, really? Proof. Take a look at this note they left. He has two hooks oh, for arms. No. This is horrible. It's pretty terrible. What are we going to do? We're going to go save her. Uh, I was hoping you would have an idea. <laughs> hmm. Let me think. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, no. What? We could get a ship and a crew and go rescue her. Genius. What an idea. Now, if we only had a captain. I'll what do about it. me? Ha! You! <laughs> That is not that funny. That is not that funny. Shut up. That's a good one. It, it wasn't hey, really funny. Hey, I'm serious. <laughs> really? Really? Okay, let's see you prove it. What do you want to prove? this way. Dun -dun 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 -dun. There's something in here that I want to show you. What's in that giant door? Something horrible. That's okay, you don't have to. Something so horrible that I stay awake at night just thinking about it. Well, it's right next to your bed. That's probably fine. I don't mean to scare you. I'm sure a big, brave guy like yourself will have no problem facing this monster. Okay, man. After all, it's much smaller than the beast that bit off my hands so many years ago. If, arr, 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 arr. if Eligante comes out of that door, I'm going to be very upset Let's with you. Let's just hope you're quicker than I was. <laughs> Let's hope. What oh, is this? I just remembered something. I never did get around to feeding him this week. Okay. <laughs> stop with that. Silly me. Oh my goodness. I'll let you open this last door yourself. <laughs> Just let me get out of your way. Wait. <laughs> Getting cold feet? Of course. No, I just don't know what I'm supposed to do. You're supposed to open that little door. And if you're brave enough, touch the beast inside. Touch the oh, beast. Oh, is that all? Okay, go <laughs> ahead. If you've got the guts. Oh, you're about to see the biggest bit of guts in the world. <laughs> what? Are you kidding me? Tickle. I'll tickle ah! it. <laughs> I don't believe it. This is that simple. You are a brave man after all. It was a you bird. Face the beast I feared all it's a descendant years. of a dinosaur. You had the guts to do what I never could. <sighs> I feel like such a coward. I'm not good enough to be on your crew. Oh, don't say that. I'm not even good enough to swab your de 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 <laughs> <laughs> Oh, come on, Mr. Uh, Meat Hook. Oh, it's Mr. Meat Hook. You're a big, strong, good-looking guy with a great tattoo. Pretty good tattoo. I can make a talk. Who want to see? Yes. Ah. Uh, maybe later. No, right now. Anyway, you can swab my decks anytime. Really? Absolutely. Sure. I can still be on your crew. Absolutely. Just pack your stuff and meet me at the dock. Oh, thank you. Thank you. 
I won't let you down! Hey, maybe I'll get a chance to show you my whole tattoo routine when we're at sea! I can't wow. wait. This is sounding better and better all the time. Boy, is it not, guy brush. Alright, well, let's use the chicken once more with the cable. I can. There we go. Get back to the mainland. I don't know how he's going to get over there. He doesn't have a chicken pulley system. And he has hands for hooks. Or hooks for hands. She's right. It does squeak a little bit. Wow. It works both ways. That's some chicken. Some chicken. <laughs> right, let's find this pass. Now he said it, Stan said he was going to be at the docks. So... Go ahead and ski that along back to the village. And say goodbye to Melee Island. This is the only time we're ever here. It doesn't come back in the second game. And... I don't know. I just, I'm going to miss Melee Island. It feels very comfortable. It's a very comfortable island, in my opinion. Hello, Stan. Hey, it's a good thing you showed up. I just look back in the day. Oh, good times right there. for you. But I said, no way. I know a guy who's in love with this ship, <laughs> and it would break his heart to lose it. Mm -hmm. Am I right? You're absolutely right. Of course I am. <laughs> I mean, just look at her. Sleek, aerodynamic. Sexy. A buoyant, barnacle-covered beauty. Yeah. Gorgeous. I love this ship. Oh. I think we're having a real moment here. Shooting star, man. I love it. I've changed my mind. <laughs> I can't give her up. What? You can have your money back. No. How could I sell something so dear? What the hell, Stan? And again, a deal's a deal, right? <laughs> right. <laughs> Good luck, yeah. I'm out of here. <laughs> Whoops, I almost forgot to give you this free seafaring literature. What is that? My gift to you. Just remember where you got it. Stands. Now many people Maybe are Maybe I should have Stan? gotten that extended warranty after all. Well, you know. Hey, okay. long time no see. Howdy, partner. Oh, Otis. Otis, I thought I'd never see you again. Hey, I could never pass up a chance to make some easy money. Dang right. Uh, um, money? Yeah, we are getting paid for this, right? I didn't know that. I, I, um, it's about the governor. Glad you could make it, Carla. Look, don't start with me, okay? <laughs> so what's that waterlogged wreck doing out there? That's my ship. How are we going to get our ship in here with that pile of scrap in the way? <laughs> Where's the cabin boy? Well, I need him to go back to my place and pick up my bags. <laughs> what's going on here? We're leaving. Where's our ship? That is the ship. We're leaving. Where's our crew? We are the crew. This isn't going to be as easy as I thought. No, it's not, guy no, They're already kind of turning against you. <laughs> All right, part two of the and there you go, ladies and gentlemen. The hard part is over with. It's smooth sailing, no pun intended, from here on out. Through the courageous leadership of Captain Free uh, Threepwood, the Sea Monkey is finally underway. Undaunted by their lack of navigational equipment or expertise, <laughs> the crew begins to plan their voyage. Hmm. First of all. I'd like to say it's great to be working with such a fine crew. <laughs> the voyage ahead is not going to be easy. It's going to take skill, endurance, and most of all, teamwork. Oh. First, I thought we'd assign some duties. What is it we were suckered into doing again? <sighs> Saving the governor. I made a list. Suckered is right. I don't see what the big deal is with rescuing the governor. She's beautiful. She can clearly take care of herself. Yes, but not... The way I look at it, we got this great ship. Well, <laughs> we got a ship. <laughs> Why don't we kick back, tie a rope to the wheel, and cruise for a while? Oh, that sounds like fun. I could use a little work on my tan. Come to think of it, I have been a little stressed out lately. I could Me use too. a rest. Me too. Then it's I'm decided. I'm taking a nap right after we this. We cruise the Caribbean. Yeah! Uh, 
I'm down with cruising. All right. Well, doomed. No, no, don't worry. We're going to be cruising in the next episode, ladies and gentlemen. It's my absolute pleasure. Keep it real. Keep doing you. That's all we got time for today. I'm going to make these videos and take a nap. Keep it real and peace.